There are many different constructions for single core cables depending on their application. So let's look at how a simple single core cable is made. We start with drawing the copper wire down to the required diameter, say 0.2 millimeters. In this case we are using tin copper. The strands of drawn copper are then bunched according to the required cross-sectional area of the final cable. So, for example, 24 strands of 0.2 mm gives us a cross-sectional area of 0.75 square millimeters. This bunched conductor is then extruded with the required insulation, in this case PVC. As the cable is extruded, it travels through the spark tester to ensure that the radial thickness of the insulation is correct and the cable has the right insulation resistance. Any part of the cable which fails the spark test will be marked and cut out during the final winding. Once the extrusion is completed, the cable will be wound off onto dispatch rings and any marked spark test faults will be cut out. And as a backup quality assurance step, the cable is again run through a spark tester. At Bamback, we work with our customers to come up with the best solutions for your job. It's what we do. We know cable.